Our next contribution comes from Oman, Secretary General of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, His Excellency Mr. Saeed Badr bin Hamad bin Hamoud al Saidi. Please, the floor is yours. Hello, everybody. First, I would like to offer our thanks to Estonia and Singapore, and in particular, their excellencies Ormas Rainslow and Dr. Vivian Balakrishnan for their wisdom, for their foresight in hosting this video conference. Thanks too to Mr. Lena Wilk for his excellent moderation. The issues raised by this video conference are of great importance. Whatever our current difficulties, we are totally supportive of its objectives as well as of the declaration that comes out of it. First, we endorse the priority of supporting and sustaining multilateralism at every opportunity. We view the proliferation of uh, unilateralism as unhelpful for peace and stability. Only through multilateralism can technologies and best practices be most effectively shared around the world. It is the foundation stone for fruitful international cooperation. Second, we endorse the principle that no one should be left behind. No one. We recognize that inequality is a fundamental challenge that needs to be addressed again in the interests of peace and stability. And last, I want to express our concern for young people. In the Sultanate of Oman, Omanis are doing their best in this regard. For instance, we have a technology investment fund to support youth initiatives and startups, which we hope will generate more digital solutions for our community in many fields, from healthcare to education. But the fact remains that right now in Oman, as in many other countries around the world, school children and college students have had their education drastically interrupted. For them, time is passing quickly. Millions of young people are in the most basic way missing out. And surely, if human capital is the key to our future prosperity, we neglect it at our peril. Governments need to consider very carefully balancing the interests of the young with the interests of other sections of our communities. So we hope an objective of this conference may be to have a specific priority of shaping a digital response to COVID and future pandemics that supports the education of the young. Thank you very much. Bringing up dimension of the education, thank you so much for the support to this digital declaration.